Hello guys, welcome to PXP Fusion and uh, this is your host PX and today AWS EC2 we gonna install the Zenkick. So before installing that, uh, you should have a AWS account to follow this tutorial and uh, just go to the running instances and as you can see here I have terminated this instance so just quickly click on the next, uh, click on this and now I'm gonna select the uh, Ubuntu 18 uh, you can select the Ubuntu 20 as well so I'm gonna go with Ubuntu 20 or maybe uh, this AWS you can choose but I'm only looking for Ubuntu 20 so let's quickly check where is the Ubuntu 20 you can also search here from the Amazon marketplace so let's see Ubuntu let's see is it available yeah so it's available and it's free tier so you can select p2 micro for um, our you know um, system configuration this will be your instance type the hardware type and uh, just click on next and now here you can go with the default uh, security group so you don't need to change anything for the time being and also just click next next and in security group, apart from steps, I would like to add HTTP and HTTPS. Also, I'm going to do this traffic anywhere. Also, I'm going to add a custom port for uh, our Zenkix. That is 8080. Just do it as anywhere, 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 and anywhere. Okay and all traffic is custom so just do it also anywhere so we need only this port here right now for Jenkins. and if you are supposed to be installing any other services so we will look into that now here i have the px security key just hit the enter and just click on the instance so before our uh, instance gets ready uh, so we gonna learn something about the Zenkings. so what is Zenkings? exactly Zenkings is basically a uh, uh, Java based uh, application which runs, uh, you know, uh, which requires running Java in your backend. So, what does it mean? Like, you should have installed in uh, Java in your system, whether it is EC2 machine or your local system. So, you can follow this uh, step by step process for your local system as well. But, uh, yeah, so Jenkins it widely use automation an open source server and it's allow you to you know uh, build the testing and de um, deploying and so many facilities like uh, it completely automates your uh, development cycle like from planning to uh, you know releasing the build so it helps you to uh, you know uh, complete uh, build a complete ci cd so that is continuous integration and development so this is how Jenkins helps you to do and Zenkings has um, plenty of n number of plugins so you can integrate any service with Jenkins like AWS, Git, SSH and n number of plugins okay so just click on the download and here you will be selecting the uh, Ubuntu Debian uh, and you can see the Zenkings is available for all the other, all other operating systems and so many things like docker is docker also in docker store you will be getting it so we'll be learning about the docker in upcoming videos for for the time being just click on it and now here are some commands so i will be explaining each of these commands one by one just now go back to the ec2 instance and just check whether it is running or not so it is taking some time it is it's still in pending so now before doing that uh we gonna get through these commands first so it is basically the repository key which will be added into your system so this will be a key for apt and then you will be adding the repository of Jenkins so that you will be getting the you know Jenkins uh, latest file while the time you will be running this command so the apt install Jenkins or get installed in Zenkings. So this is how you will be adding the binary and the repository of your uh, of your Zenkings in your particular system in Debian based Linux system. So now just quickly I'm gonna SSH into this. So just uh, I'm gonna open my terminal. So this is my terminal. So the key I have downloaded in my download folder. So here I'm gonna hit that. Uh, now we gonna install this particular version of uh, zdk in our uh, 
system that is here open jdk just quickly hit that here so java is being installed it's gonna take some time i guess so just right after java and get installed we will be adding the repositories which will be this command here as i already explained just wait for things to get done now just add the repository first then the second command we're good to go now again you need to update the system as you just added the repository so the repository file need to be updated okay now it's done now simply just run this command we don't need to add sudo but it's still it's here so no need to worry about it so i'm installing jenkins here and we're good to go So just that i'm also gonna refer you through this uh article of digital ocean you will be getting the link in description also the above things we have also already followed but here are um two or three things you need to know like uh, the ports you should do uh, open your fire firewall for this port I, I have already opened but you can run this command if you are running in local so you will need to open your 800 port for this and enable AFW for you know allowing SSH open SSH fire here fire of your public IP just hit here and just hit zero hit zero and you will be finding the tanking up and running here wait for some time things are taking time because it just installed Jenkins, so this will take some time. So it is getting load. As you can see, uh, you have successfully installed Jenkins in your system. And please wait, Jenkins is getting ready. So you need to wait for this. It will take some time. So finally, we got this screen. There were no such error. And um, it was just taking some time. So this is your key. Just paste the key here. And uh, where from you will be getting this key? Just from here. Just copy this address but i got this key from uh error log but you just need to cat and uh, just go to this particular path i'm so sorry cat and just and you will be getting your secret key here this is your secret key i have added it just click here on it just install uh, suggested plugins these will be the required plugins so like just suggested plugins it will be installing in the system and server click here response time okay you just click on retry you might want to face such error so just click on re retry so that it will restart the wizard to install the plugins loading again just click here and wait for the response okay so things are getting started and the templates are getting installed the folder and the gates and there's so many plugins are getting installed the gradle is very important so gradle is getting installed matrix mail extension ssl build and these are kinds if you like uh fail to install any of these plugins so you can try like retry here you, you will be getting the option to retry and continue so just retry if you fail to install any of these plugins because when later if you will perform certain tasks so it will uh you know it will throw some error and that's will be like very painful for you as well so see here there are so many um default plugins have been installed and things are still getting ready and getting started Just wait for console okay so here you need to add your uh, username and password so i'm gonna you can leave any of these things like email and certain things as well but yeah yeah i'm mentioning the things here you can save this username and password and this is the your zenkins url which is running at this so see this is the api uh, uh sorry the 
ip address and your port 80 so you can uh change the configuration from here like if you are supposed to be running in any other port so you can change it from configuration file and from here as well so for now just finish it okay so jenkins is ready now just wait for a few more seconds Okay, so finally you are into your Zenking dashboard. So in upcoming videos, you will be uh, learning the, about uh, other features and how you will be using Zenkings in your particular system and how you will be learning. For this video was only to get into the Zenking system and uh, install it. So just um, no need to worry about it. And uh, just um, subscribe to my channel if you are looking forward to learn Zenkings and upcoming video will be related to Zenkings. So cheers guys.